the closed drivers behind the lines. Starting match, 62 in three, two, one, go. Blue Alliance starting quick with one, two, three, four, five. Make it. Let's see if we got six, seven, and yep, we got a pure eight cargo autonomous for the Blue Alliance, giving them the lead in this qualifications match. Let's see if they can keep up the pace on the Red Alliance. That's Roscoe, the robot from Hoda Shalon. A dream team just short while three blue cargo make it immediately to the upper hub courtesy of Steampunk and Orbit. Orbit doing a couple of long shots, shooting while driving, one hand behind the back, no problems at all. Steampunk. First blue cargo, second blue cargo installed. They're going high. One, two. One of them just bounced out, but that still gives them already 80 seconds to the end of the match. 40 cargo for the Blue Alliance. This is starting to look like a potential world record if they can keep up this pace. Strong defense from the AIS Falcons trying to keep 30, 75, a dream team from scoring. On the other hand, we see Demacia trying to control Parker, the robot from Binyamina. Orbit, you need, you need cargo in order to score them. One in, the other one they intentionally throw aside. That was a red cargo. And Steampunk collecting another couple under defense from MA, but no one can stop the orange and black machine from Ranana. 140 points to 36. 30 seconds left. The Falcons have already reached the traversal rung. We are now looking for all the extra points we can manage. Pinyamina, Orbit, alone on the field. Let's see how many they can do. One, two, three. Four, just misses. Five, will it reach? Double traversal on the Blue Alliance already. Six, this looks like a world record with 67 cargo on. Con chez la Brit. Hak Hula, MC Olam Khatash. Oh, Bipim Steampunk, Kim Otsi. Um, the Otsiolan, the 